Star Citizen has been running the Invictus celebrations for a week, with a free fly event for new players and a number of ship sales. But many of those who take advantage of the ship sales will be existing players, seeking to build their dream fleet and willing to put more money into the game in order to make that happen. I'm Farrister, and in this video we'll explore some of the things that have been going on in-game this week, as well as contemplating how much it truly costs to play Star Citizen. Now, I know many of us are proud to support this game, and therefore paying a little extra might be okay. But equally, Star Citizen has attracted its fair share of criticism for some of the high ship costs, and so it's a topic that can't be ignored. As far as what's been happening in-game this week, other than the servers struggling with player demand, the in-game events have been generally well received. The show halls at the Expo Centre on Microtech look absolutely fantastic, and have been rotating across different manufacturers each day, offering players the chance to rent ships for free to try before you buy. I would always recommend this, especially for anyone wanting to spend real money on in-game ships. Further, there's the Javelin Tour and Bengal Flyby, which are well worth a look. There's a video up on this channel covering the Javelin Tour and sharing some cinematic shots of the inside and outside. But looking at the Star Citizen funding page, it's very clear. A lot of people have been very active in the store this week. I take the figures on this page with a pinch of salt, as it's data provided by Star Citizen themselves, and accordingly the figures could be massaged somewhat to show what they want to. But even just talking to the people I fly with regularly, I'm left with the impression that a lot of people have been spending this week. And by dividing the $366 million raised by the 3 million Star Citizens, that page would suggest that on average, each player spends at least $117, which is a lot more than any other AAA title. But then, Star Citizen hopes to be something a lot bigger than other AAA titles. Which leads me to ask, dear viewers, did you buy a ship this week? Was it a first ship? Second ship? Or maybe you've got your own little fleet? Let me know in the comments. And if you've not visited the event in-game, I'd really suggest getting online and seeing the sights in the coming days. Otherwise, as always, thank you for watching, or in this case, listening to my rambles.